Mr. Chair, Council Members, I'm Kari Okimoto of the Honolulu Police Department. We have concerns about Bill 3 as it relates to budget issues. We do not have the staffing to recover property, nor do we have a facility to store the items. In addition, if we are tasked to recover property, it may impact calls for service because our policy calls for immediate submittal and inventory of any recovered property, which will take officers off the road. Also, our policies do not allow the destruction of evidence if no one recovers it after 30 days. Thank you. Thank you. Members, any questions for the testifier? No questions? Thank you, sir. Anyone else on Bill 3? Bill 3? Please come forward. State your name for the record. Offer your testimony, sir. Morning, Chair and Councilman. Uh, I am um, in support of uh, public sidewalks being cleared of nuisances. The first nuisance I would like for the mayor to call the uh, chief of police about is a nuisance that was created at Thomas Square by all the flower boxes around the block, the sidewalk over there. Now, removing people's tents, et cetera, to for obstructing the sidewalk and then obstruct the sidewalks, there's got to be another answer than that. So I just ask that pass the bill, ask the mayor to ask the chief police to go over to Thomas Square and remove those uh, fire boxes over there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Members, any questions for the testifier? Anyone else on Bill 3? Bill Vice Chair Anderson. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. First of Bill 3, uh, Chairman, I'd like to thank the Honolulu Police Department for coming forward and offering their testimony today. I do look forward to the upcoming committee discussion and in working with my colleagues as this council has advocated the policy that requires our public sidewalks to be free and clear and uh, safe for passage for all of our members of uh, the public. With Bill 5. Anyone else on any of these first reading items? Council Member Harimoto, please, sir. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Um, just on three items. First is Bill 71. On Bill 3, uh, with sidewalks. Um, again, in previous discussions, um, I did express large concerns about these kinds of um, punitive um, bills. Uh, we fully understand that the impacts that. Um, uh, block sidewalks have, and we need to do something. But um, again, I've, I've expressed um, constantly in committee uh, discussions that I am not convinced that, that we're on the right direction. And further on this one, uh, it, uh, I believe it overburdens HPD, as we've heard. But I'll, just, I'll save my further comments uh, for committee. But I will definitely uh, vote with reservations on that and probably not um, going forward. All right, any further discussion, members? First reading. Council Member Chang. Thank you very much, Mr. Chair. Since it is first reading, um, I'll keep my remarks brief. First on Bill 3, I'll vote with reservations on this measure. Um, the issue here is not about keeping our sidewalks clear or not clear. I think we're all on the same page that our sidewalks deserve to be used by the public for public egress and ingress. The bigger concern is the burden on the Honolulu Police Department, which is tasked with responding to emergencies, big and small, um, at 24 hours of the day. And as we've heard from the testimony provided by HPD today, I am not convinced that the resources exist today for HPD to step up their level of participation in this issue. Um, concerning Bill 5,